Hi guys, my name is Harry. A month ago, I shared with you guys a project I made, that is a restaurant chatbot, a chatbot using the Facebook Messenger platform. I also made a video to show you how to set up and run this chatbot. But then I received many questions asking about making this chatbot to support other languages, because until now this chatbot only uses English. That is the reason this video comes in. In this video, I'll show you the version two of my chatbot, which will support multiple languages. Let's get started now. This is the setting sessions for our chatbot on Heroku. If you saw my previous video setting up and running the restaurant chatbot. It looks the same, but we have an extra parameter languages. By default, this chatbot will display information in English. Let's take a look at our chatbot. This is a Facebook page which I already embed the chatbot. With the default option, everything, including button texts, will be displayed in English. The question is, how do I make this chatbot display information in other languages? Really simple. All you need to do is changing the setting up on Heroku. I made the version 2 of the chatbot to support English, Spanish, German, and French. In the later part, I will show you how to add a new language for this chatbot. After we made changes to Heroku settings, it took a while for our app to restart. Now try again with our bot. I will start our conversation to see the difference between the old and the new version. As you can see here, now our information is displayed in Spanish. We only made changes on Heroku, then our bot will be updated automatically. The next question you may ask is how could I add my own country language to this chatbot? First, let me open up this chatbot source code. In this file, I add a comment to the new parameter so it will be easier for you to know what they are using for. In this project, I created a new file, Java Labels. We define all the languages in this file. All the texts, images used for the chatbot, we all set up in this file, all in one. To add a new language, we need to copy this block code, then paste it at the bottom. Change the keyword for your language. As the new text, we keep the key and only change the value for each object. After that, you need to deploy your chatbot to Heroku and make it work. I'll do that part in the next video, but if you want to use this chatbot right now, you can watch my previous video. This video will guide you step by step to set up a chatbot with the Messenger platform. And this is the setup session I use for my chatbot. Last but not least, I really need your help to get the 1000 subscribers milestone. So please subscribe to my channel to get more useful content and comment your email below to get the source code of this project. Thank you for watching my video and see you in the next video.